Namaste. Today's video is about Garuda Asana, the eagle posture. The asana has got four main benefits. It's a balancing pose, therefore it improves sense of balance and focus. Improves the flexibility of the shoulders and arms. Improves the flexibility of the hips and it's a good hip opener as well. Also, it improves the capacity of lungs. Let me show you how to practice this asana. I stand straight with my feet together and arms tight. With an inhale, I bend up my one leg like an L shape and catch my waist. With an exhale, I try to coil this leg around the other leg by bending the other knee. Like this. And then I inhale and coil my arms. So when my right knee is on the top, I bring my left arm above the right, like this, with an inhalation. You can see how to coil the arms. The direction of the palm will remain the same when you coil it. So when I bring my right arm above the left and coil it like this, the direction of the palm remains the same. The right palm faces the left, left palm faces the right, like this. The other side also is the same. So when I bring my left arm above the right, like this, the direction of the palm will remain the same. It doesn't change. It's like this. You can see this is how you coil the arms. So when you coil it in the middle of your face, one eye will be on one side and the other eye will be on the other side. You have to gaze at a single point on the opposite wall Steady gazing, Ekagra Drishti. Then take two breaths here. Breathing in this asana is slow Ujjayi or ocean breathing like this. Regulated ocean yogic breathing. After two breaths, exhale and uncoil the hands. Inhale, stand straight and straighten the top leg. With an exhale, bring the leg down, hand down. Relax. So this is Garudasana. Now, seniors, you should go for a second coiling. So how do you do that? So when I am here, exhale. Now taking an inhale here first, exhale coil once again, like this. You can see I have locked my feet behind the calf and then coil the arms. Uncoil the arms, inhale stand straight, exhale keep the leg down. That's the second level. Practice this asana on both the sides. So when your right leg is on the top, your left arm will be on the top. Similarly, when the left leg comes on the top, the right arm comes on the top. So this is eagle posture. Let me recap the benefits of the asana. It's a balancing pose, therefore it improves focus and concentration. Due to the coiling of the arms, it improves the flexibility of the shoulders and all the joints on the arms. Due to this coil, you can see the backside of my lungs expands here. Therefore, it improves the breathing capacity. Due to the coiling of the legs, the joints of your legs like hip joint, knee, ankle, all these flexibility will be enhanced. Also, it's a good hip opener. So, it's a balancing pose good exercise for your shoulders, hips, legs. Practice this as part of your daily routine. That's the eagle. Namaste.